Do you have to pay to use the iPhone 13? Of course, every iPhone comes with its own price tag and that monthly bill from the carrier, but what's often one of the biggest hidden costs these days is cloud storage for backing up. Of course, you wanna have a backup copy of your photos, videos, contacts, all that important stuff, but backing up to the cloud often comes with some big caveats and you're basically paying for it indefinitely. There has gotta be a better way, and luckily, there it is. Let me introduce you to the ultimate backup solution powered by this video sponsor, Synology. They offer an incredible lineup of high quality, versatile devices that give you peace of mind by safely and securely backing up all of your precious data, plus so much more. In fact, the Apple Circle wouldn't exist as it does today if it wasn't for Synology. So let me tell you guys a story that you haven't heard before. As amazing as technology is in 2021, it seems like we have more precious data to protect than we ever had before. Photos, videos, documents, projects, so much is stored on our phones and computers that is totally irreplaceable. Sometimes the unexpected can happen, whether you accidentally delete a file, a hard drive goes bad, your phone just smashes into a million pieces, Losing photos, videos, your precious files, it is a horrible feeling. It's happened to me, I'm sure it's happened to you, and it's one of those things that once you go through it and you lose that data, you wanna make sure that it never happens again. And I'm sure you've gotten prompted to buy more cloud storage on your phone or sign up for an online backup service. Those oftentimes come with their own caveats and challenges, especially if you're trying to back up multiple devices, it can just get a little confusing and expensive. So instead of trying to make all these cloud services sort of work for you, why not just make your own cloud that works exactly as you'd like it to? That's exactly where Synology is here to help you do just that, to make your own personal cloud. They've got an excellent combination of really premium hardware with amazingly capable software that'll let you safely and securely back up all your files and all your devices, and that's just the beginning of all the amazing things that Synology can do for you. Now, I am chomping at the bits to talk about some of the more advanced stuff and all the really cool things that Synology devices are capable of, but first things first, let me get the base out of the way and sort of start from the beginning. This is the Synology DS1621 Plus. It's what you would call a network detached storage device or commonly referred to as a NAS. Think of this NAS like a big external hard drive that's also a small low power computer as well. So it can store a bunch of your data on those hard drives, but it's also smart enough to run apps and do things automatically without you really ever having to interact with it. And because it's connected to the network, it can be accessed by all the computers at your home or all the computers at your office if you have this at work and thanks to the power of the internet, it can be accessed from anywhere in the world as well, thanks to the power of the World Wide Web. Now you can configure your Synology with the hard drives of your choosing, depending on the model you get and how many hard drive bays are available. But with our unit here, we're using six four terabyte drives provided by Western Digital. They've also been in the data storage business for years and years. They make some really great, high quality, reliable drives that are capable of doing just about anything. Once you've got your drives installed, the Synology setup process is incredibly intuitive and you'll be sort of walked through the entire process step by step and also guided through the type of RAID you'd like to use with your Synology device. Now, different types of RAID offer different levels of redundancy so you don't lose data if a drive was to fail. So for example, in my Synology device here, I'm using RAID 5, which means I could lose one of my six drives and still not lose any data. I can pop out the bad drive, pop a new one, the data storage pool will be rebuilt, and I didn't lose a single byte. Now, because this is a computer, it can run apps, and there are dozens of really useful apps you can download and run on your Synology, but first things first, let's start with backup. Now, if you use Macs and you're really comfortable with Apple's Time Machine backup software, you can of course set your Synology as your backup drive through Time Machine and automatically backup all the files in your Mac to your Synology device. But again, one of the benefits here is that the Synology is on the network. So all the Macs in your home or all the Macs in your office can all automatically back up through Time Machine to your Synology device. And best of all, there's no monthly cost, no annual fee. Unlike iCloud and other storage options online, there's no cost associated with these automatic backups. Synology also offers Synology Photos, an app that will automatically back up all the photos from your phone to your Synology device wirelessly. No monthly payment, no license, no subscription required. They also offer Synology Drive, an app that kind of acts like your own personal cloud that seamlessly syncs files between different devices. So you can start a work file on your laptop at work, pick it back up on your computer at home without you really ever having to think about it. 
Synology also offers Active Backup for Business, a really powerful backup tool that'll automatically backup computers on your network at set time intervals. And again, it's totally licensed and subscription free. And so if a work computer gets a virus or a file goes missing or gets deleted, there's no sweat, no problem involved because you can just easily roll back through the power of Active Backup for Business. And taking things a step further is Hyper Backup, which adds an extra layer of security and redundancy by backing up the entire contents of your Synology NAS to the cloud. So you've got a second copy of all of your precious data. And I can tell you from personal experience just how important it is to have all your files safely and securely backed up to a Synology device and sort of having this as a permanent part of your workflow. For example, here on the Apple Circle, we're constantly juggling video files, audio files, oftentimes multiple projects at once, whether it's videos for the channel, sponsored content. Suffice it to say, if we lost any of that data, it would be a really big deal and something we don't want to happen. And in fact, just a couple of weeks ago on another Synology device we have, one of the six drives just out of the blue decided to fail one day for no rhyme or reason, it just failed. Now, if this was any other device or a hard drive in my computer, it going dead would have been game over. I would have lost everything. I could have tried to have recovered it, but I probably wouldn't have gotten most things back. It just would have been an absolute nightmare and a horrible headache and would have taken basically the whole day to try to fix this problem. But luckily, through the power of RAID 5 and Synology, it was simple. I popped out the old drive, popped in a new one, the storage pool was automatically rebuilt, and I was back up and running in like 20 to 30 minutes. I didn't lose any data, and thanks to Synology, my data was safely and securely backed up, and I didn't even worry about it. Something else I personally just really appreciate about Synology is that these devices can grow and adapt to fit your workflow. If you wanna start with a few drives and sort of just do backups, you can totally go that route. It's a great way to go. But if you wanna to start to really harness the power a little more and run apps and build out your workflow, Synology can definitely grow into your workflow and meet your needs. For example, Synology also makes available a 10 gigabit network card that can super easily be installed into compatible units like our DS1621 Plus. And with that connection, not only can I push way more data, but I can even edit directly off of it and still have that redundancy built right in. In addition to that, there are also so many feature-packed apps to let your Synology do so many cool things. You can use it as a media server to stream all your content, a VPN server, a web development platform for building websites. There are so many awesome things that your Synology can do. At the end of the day, I just really appreciate Synology for a couple of big reasons. They are a leader in this industry. They have been in this business for years and they just offer a great lineup of high quality devices that are built well, they're premium, combined with the software that is capable, versatile, it gives you that ease of use and also that peace of mind knowing that your data is safely and securely locally stored. And if the worst happens, data loss, a virus, whatever the case may be, you can safely and securely get back your files and your precious data super easily. And also Synology devices just grow to fit your needs, whether you're using it at home, using it at work, you're a professional, a consumer, Synology has got a solution for you. So if you guys wanna learn more about Synology, check out all their devices and their solutions today and see what works best for you, which I recommend you do. Hit the link right down below to learn more. I love Synology. I know you guys will love it as well. So learn more, check out all Synology has to offer at the link right down below. As always, thank you guys so much for watching. I really appreciate it. Again, a big thanks to Synology for sponsoring this video. I'm Robert Rosenfeld from the Apple Circle, and I will see you all in the next one.